Hello everyone. Well, today I'm going to share with you guys about the plastic finance. Well, it is such an amazing platform, which is the uh, the first blockchain based plastic bank in Indonesia. And uh, it can uh, lift garbage collectors out of poverty with the help of this plastic finance platform. Well, they are willing to give the poor access to bank loans through decentralized finance. Well, plastic finance will improve access to employment, education, services and technology for many Indonesians. Also, they are going to help government achieve green planning on the ecological budgeting through soil protection and they're going to cleanse the environment and benefit from it at the same time right so this blockchain technology and stable coins can play great roles in incentivizing every households and MRFs or material recycling facilities to streamline the funding of plastic recycling industry well using the smart contract the uh, they can uh, tokenize each type of plastic grinds and uh, plastic uh, regrinds and pellets well, which create an internal exchanger so people and industry can have easy access to monetize the plastic waste. Well, in addition, they are uh, creating a decentralized finance application or a DApp. Uh, so this waste can be um, collateralized as assets right now this platform is actually uh, you can uh, join with this uh, community through this uh, telegram uh, uh, telegram group uh, telegram official group of the plastic finance right here you will find the uh, links right uh, all, all the necessary social media links right here anyway so now let's uh, talk about their uh, plastic waste and what are they planning with it right so uh well uh, before that let's um this is uh, their white paper right here and they have explained with great details about their uh, missions and visions and features and everything so go through this and get to know more about this amazing platform well now uh, the plastic waste that will be used as a benchmark for stable coins is polyethylene and high density polyethylene because this type of plastic waste is the most widely used consumer goods by the community for example soap bottles shampoos uh, and uh, water bottles etc well so there's two main groups of uh, processed plastic waste and plastic uh, regrind and plastic pellets and for each of the group can be divided into high density which is uh, high density polyethylene HDPE uh, regrind and polyethylene uh, regrind well, uh, poly uh, prop propylene uh, uh, regrind in fact uh, well mm, then uh, which uh, actually pluses the high density polyethylene and uh, polyethylene pellets and uh, polypropylene pellets so this uh, since the house uh, most households waste result uh, plastic raw materials that need to be converted to plastic regrind before further processing in um, uh, processing in plants into pellets well so uh, they are going to focus into two types of stable coins first of all the uh, hdpe uh, regrind and pp regrind right so these two groups of regrinds will be represented as a stable coin where one coin represent one kg of uh, a type of regrind so this is uh, pretty much about this amazing plastic finance uh, platform today and about their uh, tokens and so thank you so much for watching and you can get much more details from their website and uh, their uh, white papers right here